Day fam. Today we are doing a fun video. Fun video. Well, we're going to share with them some some good stuff. So the Bible not fun. Well, the Bible's fun, but this is something that's different. She needs prayer. This is a pray for her. This is a different type of fun. Mm -hmm. So anyway, as you saw by the title and the thumbnail, we are going to share with you all the behind the scenes and videos and pictures of our baby showers. Two. Well, I said baby showers. Yeah. 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 So the first one is the baby Q shower. And that was hosted by my mom and sister. And um, we had it in Maryland. Mm -hmm. And my Aunt Lauren and Aunt Tamia, I have to give you a shout out because you also were a great help. Y'all did so much. And a shout out to you too, Mrs. Vaughn. Thank you so much. Thank and you. Thank you. it was Thank just you. so awesome. So um, as I said, it was a baby Q shower. What's that mean? So you tell us. So the theme was like a barbecue, you know, at the house, family, friends, and just celebrating, having good old time, like cookout style. So instead of barbecue, yeah. they changed it to baby Q. No babies were roasted or grilled during the celebration <laughs> of this shower. <laughs> you are silly. So one of my favorite parts um is the food of course so what did we have always the food right so what's the kind of things that so we, we had? had chicken we had uh burgers and dogs we had uh baked beans and uh corn, corn. we had some potato salad yeah we i think some? so we had the cheese trays with the pepperoni yeah, crackers a little appetizers stuff yeah like that. So, so it was food food and more food yeah so let's get into the decor oh boy. <laughs> of the baby shower. This sign was designed and created by our very talented brother, Eric, who also was the chef. So we got this fancy over the top cake because of this one. It wasn't yeah. over the top. Let me tell you about this. So <laughs> she's Googling cake ideas and she wanted like this picnic basket with this baby crawling in. It looked like the, the basket was eating and trapping the baby. So I, was, <laughs> I wasn't a fan of that. But then I let her go ahead and pick her thing and they found this beautiful cake idea where it's just like the baby's bottom and the diaper and the legs. And it looks like it has like a little blanket picnic blanket over top of her so I was okay with that it came out really nice yeah uh, baby even had a little color yeah I don't think the cake was our know. idea I think well whoever yeah, thank, thank you Courtney and Courtney and all y'all thank you so much yeah. for not doing the trap baby in the basket <laughs> I appreciate that cake was very good it was yes. delicious um if you don't know our child's name uh, it was on the cake her name yeah. is Peyton P-E-Y-T-O-N and Ashley was so in love with her grandmother yes. that she wanted to name her daughter after her. So her grandmother's name was Elizabeth Payton. Mm -hmm. um, Ashley's middle name is Elizabeth. Elizabeth. So we took her grandmother's name and flipped it and her name will be Payton Elizabeth Ramsey. Did I do that right? That's right. Okay. Now, check out the little clip from the games. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Weren't those fun games? Can you believe who won those games? One was my um, goddaughter, Bahia. I could not believe she guessed. You how big you were. Yeah, the measurement of my... I, she was like to a T. And then... I said there's a lot of cheating going on during that game, too. Just, yeah. Just saying. But she did not cheat. And she still won. See? Mm -hmm. Cheaters never win. Oh, please. Um, <laughs> so, who was the second person to win the my game? My nephew. Micaiah, yes. who was just wanting to rip the box open, and yes. then he win and started jumping up and down. We missed that part, I but know. he got all excited. I'm so mad they didn't. He did a little <laughs> victory dance. I'm oh, so mad man. they didn't get it. But he was just so excited to play that game. Mm -hmm. He was so cute. Mm -hmm. And um, what did they win? Do you remember? It was like some body lotion or uh, whatever what was in that box. or something, which was not appropriate for him. So his mother claimed yes. the prize. Yes. Okay, lastly, we did the gift opening, and it was basically after everybody left because at this baby shower, as you know, we live in L.A., and it was in Maryland, um, we didn't have people really bring gifts, so they did gift cards and monetary gifts, and, they, and they shipped gifts um, ahead of time, yeah. and so uh, we did whatever gifts that we did get there, we just opened them you know, last minute at the end of the night. And let me tell you, in this video you see, my feet were so swollen by the end of the night, by the end of this Kinkles. event. Oh, thanks a lot. Um, <laughs> they were so swollen that I just put them up and Skip helped me open the gift. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, Oh, I love these you. colors. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I would like to ask Skip, mm -hmm. and I'll share myself, what was your favorite moment from that baby shower? From that baby shower, uh, I just have to say, just talking with all the friends and family that came. Yes. I mean, because a lot of those people were at our wedding, and then since we live in L.A., we don't get to see them all the time, mm -hmm. so... To the love and support for the people that came from that were like in Maryland, but even those that came from out of state, yeah, just for the day, just for a couple hours. I mean, that was so great to mm -hmm. see them. Uh, greatly appreciate it that you guys would support us, extended family. I love you all, yeah. So that was my favorite part, yeah. That was also my favorite part, just seeing um, all of our friends and family and how far they came is like insane, like hours and hours of driving some like my best friend with four kids in a car driving from far like it was just that was one of my favorite parts too another favorite was um we got videos of each guest um giving words to Peyton and um you know sharing our love with her and saying who they are and so um Here's just maybe a little example of that one. I can't wait to meet you. Your auntie can't wait to meet you, baby girl. But we won't show you um, all the videos because it's especially for Peyton. Oh my goodness, how could I forget? Dancing with my niece was one of my favorite parts as always. That's it for baby Q shower. Up next is... Baby shower number two. So baby shower number two took place here on the West Coast. Uh, it was at my school and I have a great staff that really shows a lot of love and support and they really did an amazing job yes. uh, with this baby shower. So to all the people that took place in planning it, uh, putting it together, the decorations, I want to just say thank you all. I don't want to start naming some because then if I leave someone out, I'm not trying to get in trouble Monday morning. So just all of you, thank you for doing all you did to make that a, such a special occasion. Yes, thank so, you so much. Let me tell you how it went down. All our staff was together in one of the rooms, and you know, teachers, administration, support staff, just everybody. Um, and they all had like great little gifts, which was kindergarten through fifth grade. Some of them had cards and you know, some funny sayings. And it was just, it was just a great time to feel the love from people that I work with every yeah. day. And then they never get to see Ashley much. So Ashley got to come down, spend some time with the staff, and you know, get to know them a little bit as well. So yes. there 
It's an intro to that. You want to talk about the food we had? Ah, uh, the food. Well, we're going to show you the food here. It was um a lot of snacks and stuff and um like some, some dips. dips and meatballs. Mm -hmm. uh, but the desserts were my favorite. Oh my gosh, let me tell you. <laughs> Those cupcakes, hopefully you see it in, in this video, but those cupcakes were out of Red sight. velvet cupcakes, but they were injected with purple dye, yes. so they look like purple velvet yes. cupcakes. It was the same colors as um, our first baby shower, which was so awesome. Because purple, teal, blue, and gray. Yeah, because I usually like to stay away from pink because I know people will get paint and pink anyway. So I usually like to stay away from pink. Mm -hmm. So, um, so yeah, it was so great. Okay, so next up were the games. And they were so fun. I got to play as well. Usually I feel like the mother um, to be never gets to play the games, right? So, so at this one... <laughs> So at this one, I got to play the games, and the first one was the old wise tales of like whether you're carrying a girl or a boy. So if if it's if your stomach's up high or low, what are you carrying? Mm -hmm. So it was that type of thing, and it was so cute. And you're then like the if you're next craving certain things, or if your mother-in-law or your mother, it it was some old out there type yeah. of stuff. And it was funny because. I ain't get but maybe one out of ten. Yeah, you wouldn't know. Those I things. wouldn't know those things. And then it was funny because some of them, some people got a lot of them right, but then they said they've had boy and girl, and those old wives' tales aren't factually true anyway. Well, one person got all of them right, I believe. No, no, but I just know they say those things not always true. Not always Who knows? true. Anyway, the second game was pretty fun. Yeah, that um, was fun. There were some items on a tray, and you had to guess. Uh, it was like sock and a passy and, you know, different oh, baby things. Yeah, baby stuff, and you had to guess what was on the tray. No, and, no, no. See, that's the trick. She just walked around with the train. Yeah, just, I'm not, I'm not done. Look. Let me tell. Let just me look. tell. Just look. So just she look. shows everybody the tray. And then for like two seconds, right? That's it. So you really, so they let you know that you have to guess like what is on a tray, or they say remember what's on the tray. So after remembering what's on the tray, the host of the game step out the room, and then they ask you a question. They say everything that she was wearing, write it down. So everyone's mind is blown because everyone's trying to focus on the tray. And we didn't forgotten. look at what the person Let's was look at wearing. what she was wearing. Yes. Although one of the staff members, I guess one of her friends, guessed like five, six, seven items wear, which was pretty good. Pretty yeah. Good. I think I guessed a few. <laughs> no. So they, like I said earlier, each grade level got together and got us like a big gift, which was cool. And then some people got like little smaller gifts. But then there was this one gift that we just got to talk about. It was that box, didn't quite know what was going oh on. Oh my god! So I put the box down, they tell me to open it. It's a small opening on the top, and I pull it out. It's like a clothesline with clothespins. Here's a clip. Oh, we're pulling, 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 and you, as you can see, the line was long. Yes. And had clothes all over it. And I just thought the idea for that to happen was just amazing. And I'm thinking the whole time, like, we're having to get stuff. It was so awesome. Something fall off. This ain't gonna work. Yes, it was so awesome because it was just so unique and so creative. And maybe like ten people were holding this line, and it, it went all the way around the room. It wasn't that many, but yes, it was. I counted. And the video, including me and you, there was the ten. Video. Including me and you, there was like ten. And so it went all the way around, and could you just imagine, it was just full of gifts. Like, you don't even think about it, but it's full of clothes and pacifiers and shoes and all cute little gifts. One gift, another gift that was just so cute, and I have to show you right here, was this little squirrel rocker. Yes, like a rocking horse, but it was a squirrel. Yes, it was so cute. So, what is one of your favorite moments from this baby shower? Um, this was a lot of laughs because, you know, I work with these people all the time. So, laughing and 
you know, smiles mm -hmm. and seeing the staff really excited as well was cool. But I, I really love it. I, I share this with the staff that, you know, it's only been like a year and a half, maybe a year and three fourths, you know, about this time of the year. And we don't have a lot of family here. You know, we do have some extended family, but mm -hmm. not like moms and dads and brothers and sisters. They're all back east. So for mm -hmm. them to come and rally around us and support and to feel that, you know, it's like a family away from home. I was just so blown away and grateful for that. Yes. So to all of you, you know who you are. Thank you, guys. Thank you, and we love you. Mm -hmm. So I guess that's it with... I guess we'll wrap up all of our baby shower stuff. No more. No, no more. more. We were supposed to have, and this is for the friends and family in LA, we were supposed to have a third baby shower or like a baby shower brunch. And I'm sorry I had to put an end to it because the first baby shower, I was 32 weeks. The second baby shower, I was 33 weeks. And... They were both so big and wonderful that I said enough is enough. We can't. You had no enough more. now. Stop being greedy. I had enough. <laughs> so <laughs> once Sweet Pea is here, then we'll have a little something and they can yeah. see her and if they want to bring her something. Us. And yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment and subscribe and we'll have some more other videos i won't oh, say fun so other than bible studies but i hope you've been checking out the bible studies is that it that's it see you next time see ya.